Friday night about approximately 9 p.m., my narcotics unit, assistance tackle unit, executed two search warrants here in Rogersville at the uh, Rogersville back outlet in the Liberty Market here on Main Street. Uh, doing a follow-up investigation to the sale of uh, the illegal K2 and uh, drug paraphernalia. As you can see, around uh, both stores was well loaded with the synthetic marijuana. Uh, it's been going on for a few months. Some was purchased by a narcotics officer sent to the crime lab and came back as having a controlled substance in it, which uh, a purchase was made again from the, the uh, both places Friday afternoon to confirm it was still going on. Search once obtained and executed. Uh, there were three arrests, two arrests made at uh, Liberty Market and one at the Ross Back Outlet. While we're at the uh, Ross Back Outlet, several people just kept coming to the store, and which time about six other people were arrested for different. Uh, narcotics violations and DUIs and weapon possessions. So all in all, uh, we took in over 700 containers with the uh, synthetic marijuana and almost $22,000 in cash, uh, surveillance systems, and uh, a whole lot of uh, drug paraphernalia. At the uh, Ross Back Out, I found a couple of liquid containers of bath salt. They were seized also. There was a lot of problem with it, and uh, my narcotics units had these places under surveillance off and on for a couple months now. And finally, Friday night, it was time to put a stop and shut these places down. They can go back in bed as long as they're not selling anything illegal. If they set up shop again, we'll be back. Remember any other place in Hopkins County?